and thanks for joining us on this Christmas Eve. This is Kevin Harlan, and by my side, Greg Anthony and Greg Beer, and from the sideline, David Aldridge. DA, it's all yours. Kevin, thanks very much. We have all heard the rumors regarding Kyrie Irving's moodiness. His teammate Kevin Durant said, Kyrie is an artist. He has his way of doing things, and I support him 100%. Irving said, human beings have mood swings. I don't have to be perfect. My teammates know who I am, and I'm proud of who I am. Kevin? All right, David, thank you. Well, a lot of redemption stories for the stars on Brooklyn. They all came here with something to prove. Who has the most to prove in the next? Mm, it's got to be Kyrie Irving. I mean, he won it out of Cleveland and Boston, and now this is his show, so... I would think internally, not even externally here in the city, but internally, I'd probably say, man, this is where I want to get it done. And some might say Durant, but listen, he's already proven he's a third. Oh, that's good about DeAndre uh, Jordan. He's a third option. Now he needs to play like a third option. They've been doing it all night long. Yeah, their energy level's been amazing. Battery bar still full, hustling, and still working hard out there. No doubt about it, he has done a ton to help his team, but he's going to have to do even more if they want to have a chance to get back in this game. Here's Aiton. He kicks it to Bridges. Good on the baseline, Jay. Bridges has got the lead up to nine now for the Suns. Well, if the defense is going to give Bridges a lot of looks like this, he's got to continue to knock him down. Jordan, the pass to Irving. Yep, it counts. And, and guys, I like what they're doing here in the second half. Getting a lot of production in the paint and, and still trailing, but, but starting to show some grit down low. I feel like Kyrie is just never afraid of the challenge in front of him. The tougher the situation, seems like the tougher he plays. And it's out of bounds. The Nets will take it the other way. Yeah, that's a tough one. An experienced player in the pro game shouldn't be making that pass. To the inside and that one clearly a foul gets the whistle and two shots coming up it's on demarcus cousins for a spindly guy durant has such great body control hard not to foul him when he carves his way in that deep and that one goes in two from the line that time sun's leading by four Ball from deep three-point land. And Aiton throws it down. Good presence there. Already in his shooting motion, he spotted the open man and made the unselfish play. Now a timeout called by Brooklyn. Definitely not pleased with their rebounding at the defensive end. The, the number of putbacks they've allowed has been terrible. I'm sure that's what he's going to address during this timeout. And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, DeAndre Ayton. Yeah, and his percentage from the field tonight, just amazing. He hadn't just been gunning. He, he's been picking his spots. And, and you need that kind of patience and discipline to shoot as well as he had. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Well, during that last break, Kevin, I got a chance to hear what Brooklyn's head coach said to the team. He warned them they've got to get back in transition. He said they've given up way too many fast break points, and he said we have to slow the pace of the game down and force them into taking some tough shots. Kevin? Thank you, David. Durant with a wide-open look. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. Happy to put the team on his back, especially in the biggest of moments. Durant nails a huge shot. At the elbow, it's Cousins, and then Cousins with the dunk. Yeah, Cousins is one of your options that you go to down the stretch, and he doesn't fear taking the big one. Next trail by five. High post, KD over Bridges, and it falls over the rim and in. KD's got 12 points now in the quarter. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. And yeah, the coach pretty smart for zoning in on him and giving him opportunities to stay with that confident play. And you talk about clutch plays, I mean, defensively and offensively. And we saw it right there. For three, Booker rebounded by the Nets. Levert from outside. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. 
Aiton's got his 20th rebound here tonight. Saw that coming. Shoots the three, and it's blocked by Jordan. And so the ball out of bounds. Jordan touches that. And Phoenix with another turnover here. And that could be costly. When the game is hanging in the balance, the last thing you can afford is to turn it over. And there's the call on Devin Booker. That'll be his second foul of the game. Irving against Paul. Inside to take the lead. And Durant lays it in. KD's got 33 points. Well, anyone questioning Durant's killer instinct can stop right now. Wow. To the wing right side. Here's Cousins. Here's another rebound. This kind of effort is amazing. And he will not be denied. Oh, the nerves on this guy. <laughs> not backing down from this moment here. When the game is close, he kicks it up a notch. And here's Green outside. Offensive rebound. Short. Gets in! Uh, DeAndre Jordan has seen these moments before. Not usually the guy called upon, but, man, delivering in a big spot. And how about that? Aiton stepping up, wanting the pressure. We've got 33 seconds left in the game. Now a timeout call by Brooklyn. They're behind by one. 29 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. seconds left in the fourth quarter and all around the rim that time before dropping in Durant's got 35 in the game down low Durant with the steal and so they foul intentionally yeah you know what smart foul you got to try and extend the game Good on the first and that will put them up by two So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a three-point game. Well, important there to have the three-point lead because only a three can tie it up now. And Cousins kicks to Aiton. Bridges, no one around him. Oh, wow, a huge basket to tie the game. Bridges has a lot of jobs for his team, but if he consistently knocks down three, he can add it to the list. And regulation now complete. We will go to overtime. And don't go away. We'll be back momentarily. Leaders in free throw attempts. Free throws always a little bit sweeter when they can add to your lead. And they've been a different team here in overtime. They just seem to have lost their energy. Irving with it. So it's Brooklyn with the win. They escaped with a victory, although they needed an extra period to get it done. Yeah, but what a great game. I mean... Both teams, I felt like, gave it their all. But when it came to OT, it, it was just all about sheer determination on their part. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. All right, David, great job. Thanks so much. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Brett Berry.